Hello guys, welcome to Mystic Illuminations Amrat and that will be Summer Solstice reading for Aries. So that will be a four card spread and the first card as we go to it that will uh, that will be what you need to address uh, in your life and uh, start executing it and this will be the Empress card guys. So with the Empress card you need to address how you treat yourself and um, most importantly what you sacrifice for um, from yourself in order others to benefit from it. So basically this card here people is telling us that we need to keep more patience to uh, how we how we face our situations and how much we keep for ourselves and how much we indulge ourselves with our day by day routine and with the profits of our job and this also speaks people that you need to start addressing more uh, the people which are close to you in other words you should not scatter resources and efforts for those which are meaningless or uh, which are not very good friends if you want to say it that way just so you can be uh, more liked by them so you can try to earn their uh, let's say their gratitude but in reality they're just uh, these people are just using you so uh, in in short guys you need to address how you spend your personal efforts and how you spend your personal comfort for people which does not deserve it so you need to redirect that and start um, <clears throat> indulging yourself more with your own personal resources and you need to start um, redirecting those sacrifices you usually do for the people who actually deserve those sacrifices now the second card guys it is what you need to postpone that card uh, this one that card particularly shows a, a field of yours which uh, or a uh, activity of yours which can't be pushed right now and you need to postpone it in the future and actually attend to more meaningful things and that is the page of pentacles this card as um, in this position mostly regards to material comfort mostly regards to let's say money and earning money so why you need to postpone slow and steady method of earning money so this card is showing in showing us areas that there are some bold actions you can do in order to increase your uh, finances as this card is all about slow and steady approach and really um, kind of aligning yourself with how much you give for for how much you gain and uh, right now as it's for the, in this position this card is saying us Aries that you can increase your monetary success quite fast after the solstice however you need to be uh, very careful here because uh, probably it's not gonna come through a, a particular devotion of yours you need to leave leave that devotion which aren't ha which isn't giving you enough profit and uh, redirect your devotion into something completely different that could be uh, a new project of yours for example you may try to swap your job you may try to swap your um, private business or you may try to open new fields where the business the business can expand what i'm trying to say here guys is that the ongoing way how you earn money isn't enough and it won't be enough people you need to try and experiment into something more and here is where your opportunities and uh, your growth lies that will be the knight of wands so the growth lies into a helping hand guys and also the opportunities lies with the experiment and with the bold actions with the readiness to put a, a calculative risks in your career or into your relationship guys or if you are not in relationship and you're single that card shows people that you need to start meeting with different with variety of uh, other human beings with that being said there will be a lot of flirting in between you two actually when we look at these two cards what you need to drop off the plate and what you need to aim for here we are seeing a devotion if you are single we are seeing a devotion toward a particular specific uh, individual however this card encourages encourages you to try with different people you just you just need to be open for more options available in front of you guys so you don't get stuck 
okay and you don't get uh, you don't get wasted in a term of time in term of effort and at the end probably a disappointment may hit you so your opportunity people uh, lies into the bold experimentations and some calculated risks that are yet to come um, and opportunities for uh, kind of like openings for risks that are yet to come and those risks are kind of calculated and you have to actually be brave in order to do so new enterprises will come from those risks guys and uh, that will be a good thing that there will be a help someone that will help you there, there. And thus, uh, if you are about to fall, this person is going to catch you or not let you lose everything that you have invested into your deeds. And uh, last card shows what you need to change. And that will be the Two of Cups. And here, I mean, what is coming as a burden to yourself. And here we are seeing a lot, guys. Here we are seeing a share in between two people here we are seeing a emotional connection in with someone which uh, is, is actually if it falls for that in that place this card shows that this emotional connection it is actually harmful people and you need to detach because uh, when you share with him a pay or with her a, a painful situation it doesn't come more easy to you actually it does a uh, boost the sense of uh, misery and the sense of uh, being hurt and when you share happiness with them i mean a happy coincidence or something happy uh, happens to you and you share it with those people you kind of sense that these people are jealous and they don't want your success so you need to kind of detach from those kind of um, harmful influences of uh, people which are seem close to you but in reality they are kind of uh, distant because they basically don't care how good you are they want they they don't want you to be better than they are because these people they feed from others misery so just to summarize all that guys for what it seems people you need to start paying more attention to yourself and to your personal standard of living if we're talking about career you need to pay attention more to your project rather than to the projects of your colleagues uh, in a term of helping them and if you're talking about a relationship you need to stop caring about what your friends needs and what your friends thinks or your friends opinions but uh, rather jump into the relationship with with full hands if we can say that way and uh, consume all of it so that was the solstice, uh, this, the solstice reading guys and uh, for Aries and I hope you find it helpful people if you do want a private reading with me, you can find my profile at mysticilluminations.com, um, 88 I think, mysticilluminations88.com, and uh, you can purchase the service there, and we will schedule the best time for you for a reading. Until then, guys, see you next time. Bye.